Hello everyone. Um, today I would like to shortly introduce you to the new digital manifold Testo 557S. Um, in this case we have here the smart vacuum kit. Um, the smart vacuum kit consists of the new manifold Testo 557S, um, then two wireless temperature probes, the Testo 115i, and the new Testo 552i wireless vacuum smart probe. So let's look into this kit. Open it. Then we have here the newly structured case. Um, on the left side, you have quick start instructions. Um, we don't need them now. And the uh, calibration protocols where it can be seen how the measurement accuracy um, is kept from the device. Also that we don't need. On this side, we then have the device and the probes. Uh, what is new on this case is that you can also put in hoses. So you can leave the hoses on the device and still put them around here. So there's enough place in this case for easily putting the hoses. Let's have a look at the device. Um, move this. So the device is still as handy as the old one um, and feels very robust. Um, on the back side, you only need to remove this strap. And then you can see that the device will directly switch on. Um, the first menu is about the language selection. So in this case, we select English UK um, as our language. And the next screen then shows you a QR code where you can download um, the new Testo Smart App to connect this device uh, with. Um, all you have to do is take your phone and scan the code. Then the country specific app store will open where you can download the app. We already did this um, before. Um, and then you are ready to use the app. We will shortly show this later. Um, the next step is just press yes, I have downloaded the app or start. Um, and then we are already in the first screen. So this is the basic screen, the refrigeration screen. Um, in this screen, you can see it's bigger than before. Um, we have the two pressures and we have a big analog display. Uh, for seeing even easier the values. And then we have the theoretical temperatures. Uh, what is missing to do actually a measurement are the temper real temperature values. As I said, for this we use the 115i, the wireless probes. Also on these probes, we remove just the strap on the back of the housing and we can see directly that the probe switches on. It looks for connection, green light shows the probe is connected. We can also see it in the display that the probe is connected now. Um, and we will also connect the second probe. Um, and you can see how the display switched. So it's scaling based, is there a probe connected or not? Now we have both, both probe connected and are ready to measure. Um, this we will not do now, um, but we will also show the ev evacuation mode. Therefore, we navigate through the menu to the evacuation measurement. Um, here, the new thing on the user interface is that you can configure target lines. Uh, how, how deep do you want to pull down the vacuum? And what is the maximum decay that is allowed? We confirm this just right now. And then this menu is waiting for the vacuum probe, which we take out of the case. In the vacuum probe, you just have to open the probe. And then there's the strap in the battery compartment. Also remove this. Then we put in the batteries again. Also here you can see it's directly connecting, waiting for the connection. Um, and now it appears in the display um, and is waiting for 
the values actually to go down to vacuum level. So we would also be here ready to start, which again we don't do, um, but we go back to the refrigeration screen. The probes are still connected, so no need for reconnection or anything. Um, and the last thing we want to shortly show is the app. So we just open the app um, and the app automatically search for the right device to connect with. Um, and it connects within some seconds. So just let's wait a short time. Now it's connected, you can see it. Um, and the values, the pressures, the temperatures are directly delivered. You can also, for example, set the refrigerant here. Let's take H2O. Um, and then everything is mirrored from the device to the app. In the app, you can start a measurement um, to also see a graphical view about the values. You can see a table view about the values. You can for sure then stop the measurement, save it, so it will be saved within the app. Um, and for sure, you also have the reporting function via CSV or PDF um, and can share this via email. So this is in very short time an overview about the new Testo 557S and I hope you have fun with this new instrument.